Hi, it is Marie and I am back again today with another video. Um, so when people have contacted me and reached out to me, the conversation usually um, turns into something about my speech. And so I thought I'd address um, my speech and my speaking ability in this video. Um, I do have to make two remarks um, right off the bat. Um, the first being that I do have a uh, mild form of cerebral palsy, so that contributes to um, where my speech is at. Um, the second is that I've had a lot of practice. Um, now practice does not make perfect, but practice does make improvement. Um, and so that has also contributed to where my speech is at today. Um, However, I do have to say, um, you know, I, I do have a good speaking ability, um, however, I do uh, still have, have trouble speaking. Um, um, that's not to undermine the fact um, that I, I, I do have an ability and I'm fortunate for my ability to speak. Um, I just... I want to keep this true, uh, and if I'm being honest, I, I do have have trouble speaking at, at some sometimes. Um, you know what what you see uh, here. Um, I put a lot of energy and and focus in, into making sure I'm speaking as clear, um, not as possible because. I, I do get a little lazy sometimes, but I do put a lot of energy into making sure um, that, you know, my message does get across. Um, however, there are some times um, when I speak um, where I feel like my mind is working faster than the sounds um, that my mouth can produce. Uh, and that is to say that, you know, I know how something should sound, I, I know how, what to say. Um, but the moment before I go to speak, it feels like I can, I'm forgetting um, how to make that sound, um, and I can literally feel myself forgetting how to pronounce everything and how to say everything. Um, I think this is um, more true with answers that are short and precise, uh, like for instance, just my name or three words, you know, there's no kind of push off, uh, there's no leverage, it's just my name and, and sometimes that comes out in like a gerbled up mess, um, jumbled up mess, and, um, and then there are some words that I avoid altogether um, saying because I know I'll pronounce them wrong, um, even though I know what they, they should sound like. I can't pronounce those sounds, and and so that does get annoying. Um, but again, I'm not I'm not trying to undermine my speaking ability um, whatsoever. I've I've had um, practice growing up. It was it was speech therapy, practicing my R's, practicing my L's, my S's, um, my S H, my C H, which I still have have a bit of uh, trouble with those two. Um, my S's sometimes, um, and then in in high school I joined the speech team. I joined the debate team, so that gave me gave me another avenue of practice. Um, but you know there are some times where you go to speak and it's just bleh, and and you know people can't really understand you, no matter how much preparation or how much thought you put into it. You're like. I'm not going to mess up this time, I'm going to pronounce this correctly, and then you go to speak, and it's like, ugh, that's not what I, that's not what I had in mind at all, um, and, 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 you know, uh, it, it's, it's annoying, it's, it's terrible when, when you, you can't communicate correctly, um, because I do think there's an importance in the, the flow of ideas, right? Um, and when you when you can't communicate, um, your your ideas um, can't be heard. And so I try when I when I talk to people that have 
more of a difficulty than I speaking. I, you know, I try to hear them out because um, I know slightly so where they're coming from. Um, but I think that's that's the flow of ideas, you know. Um, and if you can't communicate, your your idea might be good, but it's not going to be heard. Um, and so we lose that that knowledge, that information that a person could give. Um, and I guess luckily today, you know, technology is big. Um, but honestly, I think I think uh, that is where I'm going to leave it today. I'm I'm starting to get off into places uh, that I have no expertise or authority in speaking. Uh, too. And, and so I will uh, say goodbye and I will see you in the next video. Bye.